What's up, guys? My name is Ron Edelstein. I started at Digital BGA, I think, December of 2022. Uh, quick backstory about me. I've been in the brokerage business since 1996. I'm currently in the brokerage business. Um, my broker dealer or upline, if you want to call it that, uh, was encouraging me really for years since 2017. Um, to, to, to get my insurance license and to start selling insurance because they felt I'd be good at it. Um, I decided to take them up on the offer, pass the test. As I was doing the homework, I realized that I, I don't really need them. I can do this on my own and start a whole nother entity. They weren't too happy about that, but that's exactly what I did. Um, I did a tremendous amount of homework on multiple IMOs. Uh, I'm an independent uh, investment advisor. I wanted to be a, an independent agent um, because I'm pretty entrepreneurial. With that being said, um, I was most skeptical really about is Digital BGA just a lead vendor or are they an IMO that provides training, resources, support, community, etc. cetera. Um, come to find out that they weren't just a lead vendor, they provided the support, they provided the resources and they provide a phenomenal community. Um, really happy here. Uh, I'd say my first big breakthrough on the platform ultimately is writing the first policy. I, I never did insurance. Um, I did a lot of homework. I reached out to top producers uh, before and after I joined. I watched every video you can watch. I've looked at every script you can read. Um, I did a lot of homework because I, I enjoy doing research, something I love to do. Uh, once I wrote the first policy and that, per, uh, and that client told me yes, the way my sick mind works is I figured I could, I could get 10,000 yeses now. Um, and I figured it out. Um, some specific results I've seen since uh, joining Digital BGA. I started December, I think December I wrote maybe 8,000 bucks. January, the numbers went up a little bit to 13,000. February, 16,000. March, uh, 24,000. So my numbers are going higher. Uh, you know, I'm really not, to be honest, I'm not too concerned about the numbers. Uh, I'm really concerned more about the processes, putting, putting systems in place that work that are gonna yield me a re result. Um, I think it helps, for me, it helps a lot uh, that I have another income, so I don't really rely upon this. So I can do this really uh, with no stress and deal with all the pitfalls you're gonna deal with because you're gonna deal with pitfalls. It's how you handle them. Uh, so ultimately, I'm grateful for all the adversity because it's gonna enable me to grow. Uh, my goal is to be the biggest producer in final expense, not just in digital BGA, anywhere. Uh, and I'm putting those systems in place and I'm taking my time as I do it. Being in the digital BGA ecosystem, I would recommend digital BGA because the people are great. I believe they're ethical and that's very important that you're dealing with people you could trust. Um, to me, that's what it comes down. It comes down to trust and loyalty. Uh, I think they're very trustworthy people. They're smart. They're on the ball. They're on the cutting edge. Uh, they're, they're, they adapt. They change because you don't want to be stagnant. Uh, you always want to you, you always want to grow. Um, anything else I could share is um, I think this whole game is really about mindset. Uh, it, your, your external reality, what's in your head is a direct ref reflection of uh, your internal state. So you got to stay positive. You're going to go through some some things that are going to be tough. Uh, most people, when they when they touch the fire, they quit. That's when you grow. So if I had to give anybody advice, and I'm giving myself that advice, is a, a, things will get difficult. You got to stick with it. You got to persevere. Um, and if you can develop that muscle of discipline, I, I believe you'll be very successful. Hopefully this helped. And uh, all the best, guys.